welcome back to your very own college IIT Ghaziabad thank you for having me webbob it's been such an enlightening day ma'am it was a pleasure speak uh, listening to you live so i have a few questions for you short ones absolutely so firstly how was your experience of delivering a talk at tedx IIT Ghaziabad so i have to tell you this that i have been resisting uh, doing a ted talk i don't know for what reasons maybe the hard work it entails and the responsibility that you have to deliver something really structured and interesting and between all my work commitments i've just been pushing it and just because it was imt ghaziabad i decided it should be the beginning of my tedx journey so i'm absolutely thrilled that i started it with where it all began um uh, the second question is considering a lot of us students at imt will be joining corporate industry and will be having very packed schedules Firstly, do you think it is important for us to have a creative outlet? And if yes, how and where do we find that creative outlet? So for me, like my talk suggested, I feel that every job, every industry now requires a little bit of your creative, uh, you know, inputs. How you look at things, how you solve problems, how you lead your teams. All of it needs creativity, which is why everyone must, uh, you know, find uh, the side to them that allows them. to unleash a little bit of their creative potential within structured structured jobs that they have to uh, of course if you're looking at complete career shifts uh, like i had the opportunity to have that's great but you don't have to is what i'm saying you know you could be in an fmcg company but you know you would need to be a creator or innovator to get your brand to get ahead so um, how to do it is a ted talk in itself but i would think not limiting yourself only to um, you know texts that teach you the marketing principles but also see how you can think outside the box is very important great answer ma'am so my next question is what would be your mantra of success for the students here who are aspiring to be leaders of tomorrow you know i've always uh, you know when when i was studying at imt there was a case study there was always uh, i think avis versus hertz there were car rental companies where mm -hmm. one was at number 2 and i think their advertising tagline was we are number 2 so we try harder for all of us at imt since its inception and i'm talking like almost two decades ago we knew that we want the iims then and therefore every imt and every student in this institute tried way harder to excel themselves and we never sat on our laurels and i think that's what gives imtians their edges and look where we are today look where we rank and every time i see you know placements and you know ranking lists and all we have we still have a a really wide uh, imt you know group from our batch and we rejoice in every little success that imt sees even till today uh, so i think yeah we set ourselves apart because we just try harder all right so my last question for today is how has your experience at imt shaped you as a person and how has it governed your career choices ah uh, well you know it was the place where you actually sort of met your half your adult side and left behind your student side so i literally grew up at the campus and of course it wasn't as privileged as it is today so we had to like literally like i was talking about earlier you know um study in the most basic uh, campus with the most basic but we always had the most fabulous faculty and i had and i had made friends here who till today you know two decades plus later are still some of my closest closest friends in life so i think i grew up here and i think uh, uh the independence and the analytical way with which we looked at everything whether it was what we were studying or how we were going to tackle uh, the goons at the back market when we used to go everything was analysis and and i think it's just it put me uh, and readied me in a, in a shape to go and meet the world outside So, ma'am, uh, that's all we have for today. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Up. It was a pleasure <laughs> speaking to you. I've had the best time. Thank you so much, guys.